were there any moments in your Mets career where you watched one of the guys in that that group get booed? Like yeah. I, I know it was a it was a different time, but um but George does anything Foster. come to mind? George yeah. Foster. I had empathy for George. Um no one wants to get booed when they're out at home by your home fans. And as a player, uh, we're one group, and I can understand it's the same thing with those guys there when they're, they're, they're getting booed, that they're protective of their uh, – it's a clan, a team is a clan, and you're protective uh, of your teammates. And no one wants to see a teammate get booed. No one. And I always felt that the booing was, was counterproductive. It, you know, it, it doesn't help. Uh, it makes things more difficult. Um, so, uh, so George is one, they booed Daryl. I mean, Daryl had great years and they would boo Daryl. Um, but I, you know, as I said, I never understood it. I think it's counterproductive. Um, but, um, they have the right to do whatever they want. They, they're paying customer and they can do what they want. You just have to buck up and toughen up and go out there and play, turn the, turn the booze into cheers by performing.